how's everybody doing on this Wednesday afternoon? Um, this is going to be an update on what's on the bench. Uh, I'm going to try something new that I've never done before. I'm going to try to weather this car. Uh, I'm going to make it sort of rusty like a barn find. Um, I'm going to flatten the tires, of course. Uh, try to do that without it. You know, I don't know. I'm, I saw a couple of videos on how to do it. Um, uh, where it don't look, you know, you don't just, you don't cut them off at the bottom, you sort of melt them down, Well, it really looks like to have a flat tire, but, like I said, this is the very first time I have ever weathered and turned, you know, rust, you know, turning into a rust, rust bucket or a barn vine. I'm not sure really how to do this, uh, so I'm just going along at it. Uh, of course, I watched a couple of videos, uh, there's some good looking, uh, how-to videos out there to how to do this, but I hate to do it to this 67 Camaro, but, uh, yeah, you gotta start somewhere, you gotta do one, I was gonna do the first truck, but I changed my mind, I'm gonna go ahead and do a car instead of a truck, uh, went and got, this pack today, um, it has got mud, sand, and light sand. I don't know if that's really what I need. Again, this is really the first time I've ever really ever dealt with all of any of this, any of this stuff. So, uh, I got the light light tan i got the tan in there so you know if i'm trying to do different colors uh there's a light brown i don't know if, can't really tell what it is but anyway it's light brown uh i do have a question though. i was going to do this as my base coat which is it is called the satin brown boot uh, boots um, I was either going to go with this with the base coat or the rust-oleum flat and this is really it's just brown I couldn't find no rust uh, paint can so I figured you know this this is close so um, out of these two, I'm going to ask y'all opinion on this. Out of these two, which one would more represent in real life rust? I'm sort of going with the rust stolen, but I, I, you know, again, I've, I'm trying to do this the right way and make it look real. And, you know, I know i got a long way to go on this one. Uh, it's going to take me a while because, again, considering I've, I've never done this before, you know, but I am looking forward to it, uh, trying to get away from doing all shiny models, uh, and clean models, you know, I'm trying to, uh, one, up, up my game a little bit, and two, I want, I want to learn more stuff, which, uh, of course, I went to Hobby Lobby today, and, uh, I'm looking, the airplane that I was going to do for the um, Pearl Harbor build, if it does happen, uh, somebody commented and said that wasn't really a good kit, so uh, I'm going to try to get me another kit that is a good kit. Anyway, that's it. I appreciate all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. I appreciate everybody that comments, and sometimes I, I don't really get to them right back at, you know, I don't really comment right back at first, but I will catch up to you and get to you. I mean, it means a lot for y'all to even take time to comment, and I just, I appreciate y'all. I mean, you know, y'all have a great and blessed week. We'll talk to y'all later.